Sujal Singh was in high school when she became an Instagram influencer. The devout Hindu clocked up 45,000 followers in a short time. Not long after, Singh joined the TikTok frenzy, which took the world by storm. When it started, I didn't really have a lot of followers. I think maybe in like the first few months, it was like maybe 300, and then I posted my first religious video. In the next day, it was 50,000 li um, likes. And I think right now, I think maybe the, the views are sitting on like 100,000 somewhat. So it was crazy to have that experience. The bite dance creation catapulted to popularity during the COVID-19 lockdown and soon became a hit among influencers. I think it's popular because of our access to the music, to the photos. It's so crazy how you're able to um, manipulate yourself into having like the perfect jawline or the flattest stomach or the perfect hourglass figure. So I definitely think that in terms of what the, the tools the app has to offer, it's definitely like a green flag to the influencers and the younger people out there. Kajal's following is still bigger on Instagram, but she finds it easier to connect with people all over the world on TikTok. I didn't think that I would be able to reach out to as many people as I, as I actually could. And I think that TikTok's a great way to like, expose yourself in terms of, of the news, in terms of what you want to be heard. You know, a lot of people have stories about um, gender-based violence and about getting the justice that they need. And I think TikTok is a great way to just you know, let the people know. The video sharing platform has knocked Instagram off second place and become one of South Africa's most loved social media apps. Sing is among the young cohort that has driven the platform's phenomenal success. TikTok had massive traction amongst the teenagers, even the preteens, when it first launched. And then that audience became the slightly older audience. So it's resonated at all ages and that's going to be its strength and driven by the uptake in the younger age group at a really intense level we haven't seen before. It means that it's going to have that ongoing momentum into the older age groups. Social media watchers believe it's a matter of time before the bite dance creation challenges Facebook for the crown. Mark Zuckerberg's brainchild still holds 56% of the South African market, almost double that of TikTok, which is fast gaining ground. Julie Shara, Johannesburg, South Africa.